Trayson Bragg spoke to Governor Brian Kemp and Georgia's Department of Public Health Commissioner Dr. Kathleen Toomey to learn the state's next steps in the battle against COVID-19. The first long-term care provider to receive a COVID-19 vaccination in our state received that shot right inside this long-term care facility. Now that we have two COVID-19 vaccines approved for distribution, the state isn't pulling any punches in its fight against the virus. In fact, they're doing just the opposite. Now that more doses of the life-saving vaccines are available, the state is moving full speed ahead with its plan to vaccinate Georgians. Next on the list are patients and providers at long-term care facilities. Why? Well, officials say the group makes up just 5% of the state's population, but 35% of the state's COVID-19 deaths. CVS and Walgreens have partnered with the state to create a program which allows the two companies to provide all participating long-term care facilities on-site vaccinations. Pruitt Health's Gainesville facility was first on the list. I can tell you, that more than 95% of our facilities across the Peach State have already enrolled in this program. And we are eager to see the vaccine make its way quickly and safely to our most vulnerable and to those great Georgians who are giving them world-class care. Now, while today is a great day in the fight against COVID-19, Dr. Toomey reminds everyone to continue to wear a mask and social distance until at least 70% of our entire population is vaccinated. Reporting in Gainesville, I'm Trayson Bragg, CBS 46 News.